People who thought nothing would ever get better for you are watching you rise again. Please scroll on if this doesn't resonate. You got a new life. You are beautiful inside and out. Pretending not to care, but at the same time, I believe, look, I don't want to speak more into your life. I'm just going to say you will get through this, whatever kind of stress. You know, there's some jealousy. Put it that way. Some jealousy. Whoa, okay. Got a lot of cards here, and I think they're all for you. Spiritual connection. There are some people who wish they were spiritually connected to you, put it that way. Or people who, that's why they're pre pretending not to care. Like, they, this came out upside down, which usually I don't put, uh, I don't say a whole lot about that. But this time I actually feel like it's because this was a spiritual connection that's supposed to be broken. That these, anyway, just let, leave this behind. No way out. Some of these people, they feel trapped. Look, I'm, there are, the veil is thin. People are pulling away from each other. A lot, a lot going on in a quick period of time right now, okay? And what I'm going to tell you is a lot of people feel trapped where they are, and they might be looking at you and projecting. You need to ignore it. That's what I'm supposed to tell you. But let them let them worry about themselves and whatever connection they're forming and the karma they're receiving. Worry about yourself and your new life, because what they're seeing is good, but you just need to pay no one any attention. Only focus on the good. They're projecting. Social media fake. Don't worry about any of this, okay? Because what's going on is everybody wants to give you an open invitation, because they know they messed up with you. They're seeing you ascend. They're seeing you go big places in your life. And they're not ready to give up. Secret admirers. See, okay, that's what this social media fake is. Um, even if you think there's hate coming your way, even if you can tell it's fake accounts, it's not what you think. And even if you think it's fake, I'm going to tell you something. These are people that will go to their grave pretending not to care, pretending that they weren't doing this. Because truly it's admiration. If you have an open invitation to come back. They would give anything for you to just forgive and forget and come back. That's what's really going on. That's why they're pretending not to care. But I want you, I'm here to tell you to focus on your new life and to tell you that you're already through it. Like, you will get through it. No, you're already through it. Let's manifest that. What else do you need to know? I mean, congratulations. You're doing really well. Keep focusing on the positive. Focus on what feeds you, what serves you. Let go of those things that don't. Let's speak right now, though, that anything negative sent to harm you only makes you more prosperous and more physically attractive. It feels like you always slip away, and I bottle up my emotions. All right, you slipped away already. Like, people watch you slip away from things. Like, you are divinely protected. That's what's going on here. You slipped away from some heartbroken people. Bottle up their emotions. Yeah, it's bottled up because they just don't, look, they, they don't have the confidence you have to ex even express their emotions, for one thing. And... Also, some of them feel like they can't even express them. They feel like they're stuck someplace. Yeah. Mm, that's why they're not coming forward. They're stuck. Admiring you secretly. Yeah. And even some of them may not admit it. Some of them may act like haters, huh? No, one, no one's watching you that much if they hate you that much. Really. That's the truth. Um, they'll move on eventually. They'll move on. If they're spending that much time on you, it's because they love you. If, even if they don't realize it, it's the truth. And that's, you know why? Because you give off healing energy. Ask for what you want. Um, you're someone who, they, they've seen you get things. They've seen you say, look, I'm coming back. I'm going to have a new life. And you made it happen. And they didn't believe you would. But guess what? You also give off healing energy. That's why everybody wants to come back to you. That's You're probably someone who strangers stop and just tell you all their problems, which can be a pain, can it? <laughs> Sometimes it's like, please don't. Please don't. Because I have my own things to deal with. I'm thinking about other stuff right now. Can you please not? But anyway, I'm just saying some people do dump on you. Some people, others though, bottle things up. <sighs> but anyway, you need to not hold back with God, with the universe. Just ask for what you want. Say what you want. Declare what you want. Ready, set, go. Fresh start. Um, that's what I'm saying about declaring what you want. And this, you will get through this. Like if there's any kind of anxiety... No, we let go of it. Ready, set, go to get past it to let go of it. Fresh start. New life. Yeah, new life. That's what that is. See, a lot of people are pretending not to care, not to care about this. <laughs> I'm telling you. You have made an impression on some people. Some people are just like shocked. They are shocked. Because they watched you just rise up over and over. They're like, what are you doing differently? They wish they could bottle up what you got. Oh, but instead, all they can do is just admire you in secret, right? <laughs> That's all you can give them. What more could they want? Anyway, what do you need to know? Let's just pull this energy in. You are thankful for the abundance that always flows your way. You set healthy boundaries and you have no fear. Wow, perfect. Because get this, 
they are watching the abundance flow your way. And it could be that you switch to being grateful because I'm telling you, that's what happened to me too. I started being grateful for everything and I started getting so much more. The abundance just falls on you when you start being grateful. Even for the little things, even for the things you don't like, be grateful for every, everything. Be grateful for every experience on this planet. And, okay, you have no fear. People are very jealous of this, this healing energy. It's like something just finally unlocked your fear, or like unblocked it. Your, your blockages are removed. People just wonder what it is. That's what it is. If they're following you, watching us, hey, it's because they're fearless. It's because they've let go of their fear. And you know, okay, you said healthy boundaries. That tells me that some people are trying to come in. They've seen this. They've seen this huge, massive glow up in your life. They're trying to come in, but you set healthy boundaries, even those that want the healing. You can heal them from afar. You can, you know, you don't have to be up on them all the time. Let them admire you in secret. I just want to end with this. You have no fear. It is spoken, it is written, and so it is. Amen.